I stand on the side of the victims, and you stand on the side of the oppressors. Have you the courage to look yourself in the eye and admit your wrongs? Make a plea and a move otherwise. We want you to be another do nothing dipshit who think his ways are infallible. How is afraid to admit when he is wrong? How will cost extremely amount of harm to innocent living beings? This is because of you. If you are that person that I despise, you people like you have break my heart. People like you. I have to break my soul, turns my into shame to call myself a human being. How much of a sarcasm are you? <laughs> call yourself humans when you are nothing more than homie or I have to say, homikinu, hominkelu. Puppet, a person, come from the Latin word for a mask. What does what person actually mean? It comes from the Latin word for a mask. The true meaning of persona is a mask. Like the ones that actors were on the ancients. Stage. In Greek. In ancient Greek. Stand. No matter how long it costs, sadly enough for the victims, all evil will one day be destroyed by the furious hand of the purifying fire of justice, of true justice, not the pathetic kind that humans have created. That protects money and corporate wars. What have I had to say? Corporate demons. This is what these laws protect. Because if they're not mean, then how can it be a crime to free animals from places of terror? And how in the hell? Go the FBI after two piglets that are being uh, freed by the by the uh, Mercy for Animals, and <laughs> there are a whole uh, hunt on the uh, on the piglets. Um, I mean, only because uh, of a corporate horse. How? Use their business uh, incubuses or the FBI to hunt after the uh, animals. In which kind of insane world will we live, people? It remembers me on the despicable abominations that hunt after the 
black slaves in the time of slavery. So forced them to be uh, work back on their plantation by their slave masters. Don't be so gullible, people. Don't be so gullible to select the same arbitrary lie, excuses and propaganda over and over again. Do your research on this. The, the crackers and the white, um, white crackers the white crackers and the house sneakers were forced to uh, search with the dogs of the slave master after the slaves have been escaped and force them to go back to their slave masters by putting them on their feet and even if their encounters in places being where they are uh, being protected they can even force them back to them with an abomination, the humans actually be abominations. If we look to the history, the majority of people are not active violent. They are violent and cruel and criminal and psychopathic because of in the eyes of the victims, because they are being apathetic to their suffering. To their exploitation, to their lives. Because they are watching it from their position. And if you are the victim, if you are not the victim, it becomes pretty easy to mock your victims, make fun of their entire existence, label them stupid and dirty, say that their lives don't matter at all, say that they don't feel the same we do, say that there are stupid automatons. Not like humans so grateful have done. With each other also over the ages. Awaken. Humans. Peace, compassion. It's not something that you that you talk about. It's something that you practice. Take sides. Neutrality helps your oppressor, not the victim of your oppressed. Silence occurs to the tormentor, not the tormented. Siding on the side of the victims is always the greatest thing. It's always the thing the greatest people in whole history have done, and not siding on the side of the victimizers. Where it happened with altruism, people. Which is happened with altruism. Peace.